graduating in May, um, and he got an amazing job in More information about Mrs. Halpin leaving hey, and I'm show choir Mr. auditions. Bond, and he's going to talk to us. We are making stories by teens for teens. Creating a platform, finding character, and giving others a voice. This is SVTV. Hey Vikes, I'm Morgan. And I'm Aaron. Here's your daily news. Mrs. Halpin has announced that she will be leaving Seaman after the school year. Let's go see where she will be going. Hey Vikes, you may have heard that Mrs. Halpin is leaving Seaman. Let's go find out why. As many people know, my husband is in law school and he's graduating in May. Um, and he got an amazing job in St. Louis working for a large law firm. So we'll be moving to St. Louis at the end of the summer. So I'm interviewing for jobs right now and looking for a teaching job. And I'm hoping for a science position in high school. Um, I'm also certified in math, so a math position would be good. Mrs. Halpin talked about her time here at Seaman High School. This was my first teaching job. Getting to start out in this district was awesome. Um, I love that it's a smaller school than what I grew up with. I love all the kids and I'm gonna miss them so much. Many students at Seaman have had Mrs. Halpin over the years. Okay. She's pretty helpful. Um, whenever I ask questions, like, she actually answers them. It's kind of sad for the people that uh, don't get to experience her as a teacher, you know, it's, you're missing out because, you know, she is, she is a good teacher and she likes, she makes it fun. I had Miss Halpin last year for chemistry. I really did enjoy her as a teacher. She was very helpful and she actually answered questions like very thoroughly, not as many teachers do. Okay. Kind of sad that uh, not everyone will experience her as a teacher. Mrs. Halpin also mentioned ways that you can contact her once she leaves Seaman. Everybody who wants to add me on Snapchat and find me on Facebook because I want to keep in touch with everybody and you can message me with questions about chemistry and physics and math and that way we can still stay close and I'm never going to forget any of you. Be sure to say goodbye to Mrs. Halpin before the end of the year. This is Augie Chappas signing off for SVTV. Good luck Mrs. Halpin. We thank you for everything you've done for the school. Now for your daily announcements. If you are a senior, today is the last day to apply for the OFG Financial Services Scholarship. See the counselor's webpage if you're interested. If you haven't seen the One Acts, plan on going tonight or tomorrow at 7 p.m. Cost is $5 at the door. The last day to enroll in driver's ed is May 7th. You can enroll through the high school website. The Interact Car Show will be Saturday, April 27th from 1 to 3 p.m. See Mr. Collins if you want to register. Show choir auditions are coming up soon. Here's Emery with more information. Hey Vikes, I'm here with Mr. Bond and he's going to talk to us about show choir auditions. So, when are show choir auditions? We have uh, two days of clinics, so April 30th at the middle school from 3.30 to 5.30. And then uh, May 1st, we are going to have a, a, a clinic during seminar here at the high school and then after school from 3.30 to 5.30. And then on the second, we have auditions from 3.30 to 6.30. What is required at the audition? So if you come to the clinics, you'll learn a simple song and a short dance. And those are the two things you audition with for uh, the auditions on the second. Is there anything else you'd like to add? No, come out and join us. We have a good time. Thanks, Mr. Bond. Now back to your anchors. If you're interested, make sure to attend. Any student interested in joining the Writing Center next year must fill out an application on the school website. Applications are due May 1st. The North Nook will be open during all fifth hour lunches next Wednesday. Seniors, you must complete the survey from the counseling department. Check Schoology for more information. Now after the break, we'll see all the teams playing tonight. Mr. Elliott is training and preparing to run with the Bulls. Run, Coach Elliott, run! If you want an official Mr. Elliott Run with the Bulls t-shirt, order yours at lunch. The cost is $15. All proceeds go to the wrestling team. Hey you. Yes you. Do you like cars? Whoa, watch out there old sport. Well, we have a surprise for you. The Interact Club is hosting a car show Saturday, April 27th from 1pm to 3pm. 
It's $15 for an early registration or $20 at the door. Admission is free to the general public. See Mr. Collins for a registration form. We'll be waiting for you. Our delayed dance team tryouts are April 27th. Tryout packets will be able to be picked up in the office and dropped off in W12. There are many sports going on tonight. Baseball is at Manhattan starting at 4 o'clock. Softball is at home against Manhattan starting at 4 as well. And girls soccer is at Junction City starting at 4.30 and JV for JV and 6.15 for varsity. Finally, our boys tennis team is at, is at Emporia starting at 3 o'clock. If, if, if you can go, please support our Vikes. Now let's blow it on over to weather to see how warm it's going to be this weekend. Hey Vikes, we're just going to keep it short and sweet today since Josh isn't here. Just going to take a look at your three-day forecast. Drastic difference from Friday to Sunday, 19 degrees. Very warm this weekend. Make sure you go outside and enjoy the beautiful weather because rain is on the way for next week. But Josh will touch on that later next week. Now, back to your anchors. That's all for today, Vikes. See you back on Monday with Allie.